Prescription drugs, how we use them and how we abuse them. We know that there are approximately, what, 7 million prescription drug abusers um, as opposed to roughly 400,000 heroin abusers. What is painful to one person may not be as painful to another. If their pain is not being well controlled, we can see something that we call a pseudo addiction. When does someone cross the line from treating pain to addiction? Once you cross the line from abuse into addiction, your willpower is gone. The addiction gradually takes over your life. Uh, it becomes the most important thing to you. It, um, everything else falls by the wayside. It can happen to anybody. It can happen anywhere. We needed outside agencies to support us in order for us to do our job and that is to educate the students. You need to educate yourself as parents and as a community. The prescription drug monitoring uh, program is an absolute must. It's essentially a database that would be managed by the state where pharmacies, after filling prescriptions, dump the data uh, into a central repository and then physicians would have an opportunity to access that data. In the state of Missouri, we're the only state in the entire country that doesn't have a PMP program.